everybody, what's up? It's your girl, Anita, the fabulous diva, back with Urban Scene for 2006. And tonight, we are going to kick it off in style, and I mean that literally, because we are here at Columbus College of Art and Design's newest exhibit, Bling. That's right, people, I said bling. Now, for all you urbanites and urbanistas, I know you know exactly what I mean, but for those of you who don't know, let me just say that bling is sort of like eye candy for jewelry junkies. Now, Columbus College of Art and Design wanted to give an exhibit to show how hip-hop culture has kind of taken over the fashion industry. Everything from M Magazine, Vogue Magazine, the Paris runways, and let me tell you, they always steal the scene when they hit Hollywood's infamous red carpet. Now, personally, I'm curious to know exactly what inspired CCAD to come up with this idea of doing an exhibit on bling. So let's go talk to a few people and see what they can tell us about tonight. I've got here with me Natalie Marsh. Natalie Marsh and Tasha Lewis. Tasha Lou. Now, Natalie, why don't you give us a little bit of the rundown as to how CCAD came up with the concept of even doing bling? Well, I'm the director of exhibitions, and we have a terrific um, fashion design program, and we also have board members that, that work in the fashion industry. And so those two came up with an idea that maybe we should do something related to hip-hop. From there, the show just developed more and more found two wonderful guest curators. Tasha Lewis right here to my left is one of those. And um, from there we just started digging around and looking in all kinds of places for clothing that would represent everything from the Harlem Renaissance all the way up to today. And so the clothing is um, really meant to dig deep into the history of urban fashion, um, looking at the kind of continuity and the ongoing influences that we see today. Okay, sounds lovely. Now, Miss uh, Tasha, tell me, how do you curate an exhibit on bling? What was your role in all this? Well, actually what we did, I'm a graduate student. I study apparel and textiles and fashion, which means we study design, but we also study the history, the social psychology of it, and how fashion changes over time. So I had done some research on how hip-hop fashion has actually changed over the last 30 years, going from its origins in the Bronx to where it is today on the runways in Paris and Italy. And so I did research on that and I really, really loved working on this exhibit because I grew up with hip-hop music, number one, but also now because it's so mainstream and I see so many people wearing it, I think it's great to share how it all started and how it got to where it is today. Okay, cool, cool. Like you, I am a child of hip-hop. Love it. That music in the background is bumping by the way. Now, ladies, um, why don't you just do us all a little favor and show us some of your bling before we get out of here? Come on, show us. Give us, give us a little, give us a little twirl. A little twirl. <laughs> Blinging with the bag. I see the lapel there, and you do, or the pocket on your jacket. Doing your thing, girl. Okay, come on. I know you said you didn't get a chance to go home and get your sparkly bling, but remember, it's all about representing who you are. So just give us a little spin. All right, here we go. Turn around, girl. And listen, I know you might say you don't have bling, but I'm checking. Give me that finger. Now that is about some bling. That's enough, isn't it? Hey everybody, it's your girl Anita here with three fine fellas who are students up here at CCAD. They're going to talk to us a little bit about bling and hip hop. But first, let me get everybody's name. Uh, my name is Daryl Unique Soul. Antonio Martin. Daryl Webb. Okay, fellas, now we're checking out this exhibit and it's talking about how hip hop is pretty much taking over the world. Any thoughts on that? Do you see it taking over any place besides fashion? Yes, I see hip hop taking over media wise. A lot of videos are coming out a lot stronger and being a lot more of an influence on younger students. Okay, how about you? I feel tip hop is really taking over just a lot of just the media, just basically dominating the whole entire uh, product line right now. And what do you think about the exhibit? Are you feeling bling? Do you think this is something good to have here in Columbus? Why should people come and check it out? Um, I think that this is a, a beautiful exhibit and it kind of give a, a lot of different cultures, you know. Uh, Kind of opportunity expression you know, see what uh, black culture is about, you know, but now to just see some positive things, you know. You know, I'm enjoying myself up here. Okay, anybody got some bling they want to show off before we get out of here? Okay, show, show us some bling. 
but you know, like I said, it's not just about the jewelry. It's about representing who you are to the fullest. It's about doing your thing, whatever that is. Okay, well, that's the best way to be, baby. Hey, everybody, it's your girl, Anita, the fabulous diva here at Bling at Columbus College of Art and Design. Right now, I have with me, we are honored to have here the president of CCAD, Mr. Denny Griffin. How are you doing this evening? I'm doing great. I'm honored to have you all here. So this is, this is fabulous for us. Thank you. Appreciate that. Now, please tell us, Denny, what you can about Bling and how, what do you think about the exhibit, about you guys having this here? Well, CCAD has a great big fashion design program, and so for us to have an exhibition like Bling here is really about the kind of the crossroads between the fashion design, popular culture, and the impact of hip hop and music on popular culture through fashion. So the exhibition is all about the kind of the history going clear back to the 1940s and zoot suits, right through Motown to up to the minute, you know, um, basically, you know, fat baby stuff. Sean John, that I happen to be modeling tonight, we got it all here, and we're very, very proud. Sounds cool, and I, like I said, you are wearing your outfit, Denny. Check out my, oh, and look at that bling! Here, Would huh? you look got, at the bling, the bling people? Bling going, now so. this is bling. <laughs> All right, everybody, that's a wrap. That's going to do it for us tonight here at CCAD's 2006 opening exhibit, Bling. I am your girl, Anita the Fabulous Diva, and I'm getting ready to get out of here because i got to go back and check out some of those fashions because a few of those things belong in my closet. Stay fabulous. <laughs>